the News 8 Storm Team Forecast with meteorologist Matt Moore. Well, just 24 hours ago, we were talking about the potential at seeing some severe weather popping up. And sure enough, yesterday afternoon, it was pretty crazy for a lot of folks, including some large hail and even some rotating winds. But today is a different story. We are talking about some much quieter weather. And you could see that as we look live from our Hanover SkyCam right now. Just a few of those puffy cumulus clouds in the sky and a little breezy, too. You can see the tree there kind of rocking back and forth in the breeze. Temperatures right now are beginning to warm up. It's feeling rather comfortable, 71 degrees. In Hanover right now. Dew points into the upper 40s, near 50 degrees. Yesterday we were into the mid upper 60s, a lot of humidity in the air, which really helped fuel those storms. Not the case today. Much drier with a northwest wind around 10 miles per hour. We will see those winds anywhere between 10 and 20 today. So it will be a little bit on the breezy side. Overall, though, it'll be a cooler day than yesterday. Temperatures are sitting into the low 70s right now, upper 60s elsewhere. But you can see radar is pretty quiet, at least as of right now. We are starting to see some of these clouds firing up with the day. Time heating with the sunshine helping to promote that. And that's because we do have an upper level low to our north continuing to spin and provide enough lift. Yeah, we'll see some clouds, perhaps a stray shower or two heading into the afternoon hour. So the News 8 Storm Team forecast we have Redding in the background, of course, around the Redding area. Berks County really hard hit yesterday. Not going to be uh, seeing any severe weather today. Just a couple of showers, and they'll be mainly in our eastern county. So Berks County, yeah, you'll have a pretty good chance at seeing a couple of those stray showers. The less likely the farther west you go, and the highs today probably in. To around the mid 70s. Tonight, a few clouds around, cool and breezy. Of course, we have a meteor shower going on tonight. It's actually going to peak 3 o'clock tomorrow morning. So, if you go through the overnight hours, if you're staying up late, it should be pretty decent viewing conditions for that. You could see anywhere between 100 to 200 meteors per hour. If, uh, on ideal conditions if you get away from those city lights. Into tomorrow, a sunny start, but a few afternoon clouds will bubble up. And again, the chance for a stray afternoon shower or two. And again, those highs into around the mid 70s. So pretty similar to what we saw today. The first pitch forecast for you. Uh, and we're talking about the barnstormers at the York Revolution in York City at 6 30 tonight. There's a t shirt giveaway. May as well go to the game Friday night. Can't beat that. 70 degrees dropping into the mid 60s. And again, we may have the chance for a stray shower. I don't think it'll be a huge issue for that. Game though. Right now, dew points are pretty dry, and that's why we're not expecting to see a whole lot in the way of showers because all of the muggy air is down to our south. You see those dew points into the mid 60s in Atlanta, and they'll probably be dealing with some thunderstorms along this cold front that was swinging through for us yesterday. But it is well off the coast now, still dealing with an upper level low, though, spinning into the parts of New England, and that's going to continue to hang around today, even into tomorrow, bringing the chance of those afternoon stray showers. Again, we'll see that uh, continuing even into tomorrow as well. But it looks like by Sunday, high Pressure does try and build in here. You see, Sunday morning we start off with sunshine, pretty much stays that way all day long before it slides down to the southeast. Winds come back out of the southwest into Sunday, and so we're going to be talking about some warmer weather heading into Memorial Day. Pretty good beach and bay forecast, stray showers for tomorrow, mostly sunny for Sunday, and those temperatures will be staying into the 70s, near 80 by the time we go into Memorial Day. So the temperatures they begin to rise heading through the next couple of days. 78 degrees, pleasant for Sunday, Memorial Day, 82 and warm, very nice there. We will watch for the chance for a few showers as we go into Tuesday, but looks a little better heading into Wednesday and Thursday.